Hi, you've probably heard of the Llama Llama books by Anna Dudney. They're great. So this is a craft you can do that is inspired by this book, a little llama made out of cardboard. It's, and here is what you need. A piece of cardboard, some tape, some scissors, some different colors of yarn, some markers, and some pom-poms, and some glue. That's it. That's all you need. So the first thing you need to do is draw out your llama on your cardboard, like so. And you can decorate it however you want, like put a little garland around its neck, however you like. And what all I did was I googled llama outline and found just a simple llama drawing that I printed out and then I cut out and decorated however you like. So then all you need to do is cut about five little notches along the top of the llama back and the same in about the same sp spots along the llama belly and this is going to hold your yarn so that you, we can weave a blanket for the llama back. So take your yarn and tie a little knot in one end. And then that knot will hold the tape in place so it doesn't slide out quite so easily. And then take a piece of tape and tape it just in front of the knot and tape it to the back of your cardboard. This is where we are making our warp for our loom so that we can weave a blanket on the llama back. So then you need to wind the yarn around the llama in those little notches that we just cut out. And don't hold it, don't pull it too tight because you're gonna need to get your uh, um, other colors of yarn through your warp. Uh, so you want to make sure that it's loose enough that you can get a piece of yarn underneath it. Okay, so then you have about five uh, strings across here and all you need to do now is cut off your yarn, tie a little knot, like so, and then take your tape and just put it on your yarn like that to hold it in place. And that's the beginning of your blanket. Then you need to take one of your pieces of yarn and put some tape around the top end like so, so that you have something stiffer that will be able to go through your uh, your strings here so that um, it's much easier to grab than if it was just the loose yarn. So then take the end of your yarn here and just tape it to the back and that will hold it in place. And then on the front here, here we are just going to weave in and out of your yarn like so. and then pull it tight. And then once you've got to the end, you go back in the opposite direction and make sure you go up and over and up and over and make sure you're alternating back and forth so that you get a complete coverage of your blanket to create your blanket like that. And then all you do is you keep going till you've reached the end of your yarn or if you want to change colors and alternate colors all you do is take another piece of yarn and tie it to the end of the one that you've got going here like so so say we want to change it to green we're just going to tie this in a knot 
around the orange piece and then cut off the ends and get that out of the way and then just keep going with your yarn and then you've got another color started and you just keep going over and under and over and under and make sure you don't pull it too tight because we want to keep the rectangular shape here so that it looks like a blanket so you keep going over under and you keep going until you're done and then it will look like this here and if you want to finish it off you can just put a dab of glue on each string and put a little pom-pom on it and there you go you have a little cardboard llama